Therefore, when they asked me to be or not to be, I told them, wrong person. And when I saw their five dollar bill, I said, wrong again. We all know Douglas has been accusing me of being two-faced. I ask you, if I were two-faced, would I be wearing this one? I am very meticulous about my appearance. Have you been to the Washington Monument recently? Looks nothing like the boy. When my wife told me, you know, Abe, you need a vacation. Let's go to the theater. And I told her I'd rather get shot than go to the theater. Indeed, the current president has followed my footsteps. When we needed to open up jobs, I traveled south and freed the slaves. Our current president has gone even further south and he's freeing the entire Mexico. He asked me for my advice. I told him, why don't you go first seek advice from the others? He asked Washington what to do. Washington said, you should abolish the IRS and start over again. He asked Thomas Jefferson what to do and Jefferson told him you should abolish welfare. When he got around to me, I told him, you know what? Why don't you just go to the theater? Let's see if he takes my advice. In the meantime, I do owe a debt of gratitude to the entire staff at Ura for making their prizes just one little fiverish. They've made me world famous. Without further ado, I'd like all of you to go now to www.ura.org forward slash laptops for a chance to win a free laptop or iPad and for a $36 donation or more, you can win both. And remember, for one little fiveish, you have a chance to win many mega prizes this Motsoe Shabbos at the Uda auction. I will now call upon the winner. Number seven. Melcher Seidenfeld, Brooklyn, New York. Borough Park, congratulations to you. You've won a choice of either one iPad or laptop. Mazel Tov.